know how to tell the difference between a grass and a sedge weed? It's a little tricky, and that's the reason why they're the topic of our two-minute pest. Tom, grasses and sedges look alike, don't yes, they? Yes, they do, and it's very important that you know the difference here because the control is different. That's the most important it. thing. Yeah. So what do you have? Well, I have a grassy weed, um, and you can see just, for instance, the flower is very different. Yeah, there you go. You know, uh, we can talk about those differences, but the sedges, you can tell me a little bit how they're different. Yeah, well, the sedge has a three-sided stem, and especially, you feel it the most when you have the flower up, and you're running around your fingers, you can actually f uh, feel the three sides. And there's all different kind of different sedges. This is green Kalinga. And, you know, this one here is kind of cute, actually. I kind of like it. And it might make a good lawn if it die, didn't die out in the winter time. But even you can see the three leaves coming off yeah. the flower are in threes. Everything's in threes. Yeah, it's a big the neat three. thing about sedge is it's probably going to be the greenest, the most upright, and the shiniest portion in your lawn, mm -hmm. actually, if you have it, where the grass is kind of very, I mean, and it's kind of dull. You got. That's crabgrass. There, if you had a real freeze, though, this would be down, and this would still be probably be, be there. Yeah, this bit. will go out during the winter time, mm -hmm. over time. Uh, but anyway, you have the different sides. And the flowers. To, Let's know. talk a little bit about the leaves. Mm -hmm. You know, here you can see you have leaves branching off the main stem. Yeah. Where here it's just a smooth stem. And they're shiny. They're upright. Shiny. They're shiny, and they're in threes. So it's very easy to tell that there. Where these are kind of dull and growing out. This and also has a runner underground too. Right. And why is it important to know the difference? Well, when it comes to the controls, that's mm -hmm. the important thing. And what are the We controls? have a lot of good sedge controls out there right now, and you can get uh, uh, nut sedge killers, what they often be called at the garden centers, and you can get those. Wherever grasses, we don't have quite as many. We're preventing the grasses more than control them, although some people use a home remedy, a baking soda, and go through a very light dusting, like mm -hmm. dust on the furniture, and we'll take it out sometimes. Well, thanks, Tom, for all this information about grasses versus sedges. Yes. Now you know that some of the differences between these types of weeds and why it's important before selecting your herbicide.